Hey everyone, welcome back to Analim Online and today we're on the road again on the way to the city of Manila and we're going to visit the National Museum of Natural History. But before that, we'll have a quick coffee at the Manila Hotel. Manila Hotel is one of the oldest hotels in the city, built in 1912 and was occupied by historical figures such as Douglas MacArthur. Hey guys, so we're on our way to the National Museum, so this is Bianca, and we're kind of lost-ish. So we just came from Manila Hotel, had merienda at 12 o'clock, like a tita. <laughs> okay, see ya. As you can see, we walked our way from Manila Hotel to the National Museum Complex. It took us around 10 minutes to get there. The complex holds three museums including the Main National Museum, the Museum of Anthropology, and the Museum of Natural History. Today, we're visiting the National Museum of Natural History. Tongue twister, right? As a lover of neoclassical architecture, I was stunned by all the details of the building proper. All the national museums in the complex are free of charge, so brace yourself for a long line that lasts around 30 minutes to an hour. We're finally inside the receiving hall of the museum, and the details of the place are still as stunning as ever. When you enter, your bags will be scanned and checked. You're also not allowed to bring it inside the museum. They have a bad deposit counter which follows a number card system. We are finally inside and greeted by the Tree of Life, the architectural masterpiece of Dominic Galicia. The tree was inspired by Charles Darwin who sketched the Tree of Life to demonstrate that all species on Earth are related and evolved from a common ancestor. You will also be greeted by the exact life-size replica of Lolong, the biggest crocodile in the world. I was kind of freaked out to be honest but so amused to see him. The museum has six floors which will take a good two hours to thoroughly explore. The exhibit floor floor include botany, geology, and zoology. Each all subdivided in their own respective ways. Most exhibits are for viewing only, but some including this butterfly display are interactive and perfect for kids and adults of all ages. Fun fact about me, my great-grandfather was a taxidermist or a professional animal stuffer in layman's terms. Hence, my fascination for all the animal displays. The marine life section was by far my favorite display. I loved all the animals, how it was presented, and the overall mood of it. Reminded me about the sea and being in the beach. Now that we're done going around the amazing Museum of Natural History, it's time to find a place to eat. What better way to go around in style than in a kalesa? For the best view of Manila, visit the Skydeck View Bar in Bayleaf Hotel. You can grab a cocktail and order delicious international food from their menu with a stunning view of the city. I hope all of you enjoyed this vlog. Please give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed and subscribe to stay tuned. Thank you and see you on the next vlog. Also, happy Independence Day to our country.